If you were to get a problem like this on a math test, what would you do? How would you find two linear equations with one solution, in this case, 4, 5? Feel free to pause the video and try this problem. So let's start with the slope-intercept form of the linear equation. y is equal to mx plus b. x is 4, y is 5. So we're going to replace y with 5 and x with 4. Now we have two variables and only one solution. So there's so many ways in which we can write uh, linear equations that will give us the solution. All we need to do is pick a value for m and calculate b. So let's make a table between m and b. Let's pick 2 for m. So if m is 2, what's b going to be? 2 times 4 is 8. And if we subtract both sides by 8, we get that b is going to be negative 3. So this is one possibility. When m is 2, b has to be negative 3. Another possibility could be choosing a different value for m. Let's say when m is 3. What's b going to be? 3 times 4 is 12. And if we subtract both sides by 12, we'll get that b is going to be 5 minus 12, which is negative 7. And you could continue the pattern here. You can make m equal to 4, 5, 6. There's so many different variations that you can have. But we'll stick with this, these two. So now that we have our m and b values, we can write the two equations. In the first equation, I'm going to replace m with 2, b with negative 3. So this is going to be 2x minus 3. And then the other possibility, I'll replace m with 3 and b with negative 7. Therefore, here are two linear equations with the solution 4, 5. And we could check it. If I plug in 4 for x, I should get 5 for y. 2 times 4 is 8. 8 minus 3 is 5. So that works. For the next one, I'm going to replace x with 4 and get 5 for y. 3 times 4 is 12. 12 minus 7 is 5. So that works as well. So that's how you could find two linear equations with the solution 4 comma 5. By the way, for those of you who want more problems on linear equations, feel free to check out the links in the description section below.